food poisoning is a fairly common and easily detectable and treatable condition. However, without proper care, the body may take longer to recover. One important aspect to consider is what to eat during and after the treatment of food poisoning. And the N2T Healthy Live channel will help answer this question in the video below. Rule 1. Adjust your diet when experiencing food poisoning. 1. Drink plenty of water. Common symptoms of food poisoning include nausea and frequent diarrhea. Prolonged symptoms can lead to significant dehydration. Therefore, it is essential to drink more water to replenish lost fluids and maintain body temperature while considering what to eat during food poisoning for a quick recovery. If it's challenging to drink a large amount of water at once, sip it slowly and drink multiple times. In addition to filtered water, you can try drinking decaffeinated tea or fruit juice to avoid a bland taste while ensuring an adequate supply of water and essential vitamins. 2. Supplement water and electrolyte powders. Water and electrolyte powders contain components such as sodium, potassium, glucose, which help replenish minerals and nutrients quickly. Nowadays, these powders are available at almost all pharmacies, just mix them with filtered water, and you can use them immediately. Alternatively, you can make your own rehydration drink at home with readily available ingredients. 1 teaspoon salt. 1 teaspoon baking soda. 8 tablespoons white sugar. 2 liters of filtered water. Dissolve and drink this solution daily to maximize fluid replenishment during food poisoning. 3. Start with a bland diet and gradually increase intensity. When nausea and diarrhea subside, indicating signs of recovery, the body may experience increased hunger. Start with bland foods such as rice, applesauce, ripe bananas, and plain bread to soothe the stomach and avoid stimulating a return of nausea. To ensure sufficient energy intake, supplement with mild savory foods such as mashed potatoes, plain crackers, boiled vegetables, etc. These are gentle on the stomach and suitable for someone recovering from food poisoning. 4. Avoid consuming dairy products for a few days after food poisoning. While milk is a nutritious and convenient beverage, it is advisable to avoid dairy products such as butter, cheese, or milk solids when recovering from food poisoning. During this phase, the body may temporarily have difficulty digesting lactose, a sugar found in milk, leading to bloating, abdominal pain, and potentially dangerous complications. 5. Reduce stimulants, spicy foods, hot beverages, alcohol. Individuals recovering from food poisoning should be particularly cautious about what to eat. Despite hunger and cravings, avoid certain foods like spicy and oily dishes, as they are nutrient-poor and challenging to digest. Stimulants like tea, coffee, alcoholic beverages, which tend to have diuretic effects, causing increased fluid loss and a risk of relapse into diarrhea and nausea. Fiber-rich foods like seeds, pill-covered fruits and vegetables, legumes, citrus fruits should also be avoided, as fiber promotes stronger digestive activity, which may not be beneficial for someone experiencing diarrhea and nausea. Rule 2. When experiencing food poisoning, consume gentle foods for the body. After food poisoning, the question of what to eat becomes crucial as the body is still in the process of recovering. Prioritizing gentle and easily digestible foods is essential during this time. Consume rice and oat water after food poisoning. After experiencing food poisoning, regular foods and drinks may lose their appeal. However, it is crucial to focus on rehydrating and incorporating gentle foods for the stomach. For example, drinking rice water or oat water can help soothe stomach pain, alleviate bloating, and provide ample hydration to the body. Supplement with probiotics. Probiotics, also known as beneficial bacteria, have various benefits for the body and the brain. They can improve digestive health, reduce depression, and promote cardiovascular health. In reality, there are many probiotic-rich foods that can enhance your health, such as fermented soy, yogurt, and fermented vegetables. Apart from these options, you can also use functional foods that supplement probiotics. These are readily available at pharmacies and are reasonably priced. People suffering from food poisoning should supplement with probiotics to enhance recovery. However, for individuals with a weakened immune system, adding probiotics may not be the optimal solution, and consultation with a doctor is advisable before use. Add apple cider vinegar. Another tolerable beverage for those experiencing food poisoning is apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar possesses antibacterial and antioxidant properties. You can dilute apple cider vinegar to make it easier to drink. To prepare apple cider vinegar, mix 2 tablespoons of apple cider vinegar into a warm cup of water and consume before eating dense meals. This can aid in effective digestion. Drink herbal tea or honey and ginger. Infusion in reality, many herbs have antibacterial properties and can alleviate symptoms of food poisoning, such as rosemary, thyme, cilantro, mint, basil, and fennel. You can consume these herbs raw or prepare infusions by steeping them in hot water. Honey and ginger are recognized as a powerful duo for a stomach recovering from food poisoning. 
Honey has antibacterial properties and can control acidity in the stomach, while ginger helps reduce abdominal pain and indigestion. Slice ginger and steep it in hot water, then add a spoonful of honey, mix well, and drink in the morning or evening for better effectiveness. Rule 3, rest after food poisoning. Allow the body to rest. Due to significant fluid and energy loss, the body needs more rest and nutrient replenishment. Resting for at least 48 hours before returning to work is crucial. Short, frequent naps are necessary to allocate energy for mental recovery. Limit strenuous physical activities, avoid exerting too much effort. Do not share towels or eating utensils with others to prevent the spread of illness. Wash hands frequently. Let the stomach rest. Nutrient supplementation is essential for those recovering from food poisoning. However, overloading the stomach with too much food should be avoided, as it puts pressure on the digestive and absorption systems of the body that may not have fully recovered. The nutritional supplement regimen must also allow the stomach to rest. Therefore, besides understanding what to eat when recovering from food poisoning, you should also consider the following. Limit eating in the first 1-2 days when experiencing food poisoning symptoms. Avoid consuming excessive or highly concentrated foods. Instead, focus on drinking plenty of water or consuming porridge and soup. Stop eating if there are still signs of nausea and diarrhea. Take ibuprofen and paracetamol Ibuprofen or paracetamol can help alleviate pain when experiencing food poisoning. However, it is advisable to take ibuprofen or paracetamol according to recommended dosages to effectively reduce abdominal pain and bloating. Additionally, you should avoid taking anti-diarrheal medications to prevent hindering the body's rapid detoxification process. Therefore, healthcare professionals always recommend refraining from taking anti-diarrheal medications when suffering from food poisoning, except under specific instructions from a doctor. Give this video a thumbs up if you learned something new today. And don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you never miss our upload. I'll see you all next time, stay happy and healthy.